welcome to my youtube channel yo babies if this is your first time being here what's goody i'm k um if you continue to be here and you're a reoccurring supporter welcome back love to have you here whatever like i promised i'm just going to do a trader's joe a trader joe's haul goodness um i didn't get anything like too too special but i will put y'all on to a few products that is busting busting okay just in case you want to go try them um i was really just mainly doing grocery shopping not like you know when you go to trader joe's and you really don't need groceries but you just want to like get some extra or get something that you've been craving um yeah that's really what it is one thing that i was kind of upset about was they're all out of seaweed before the little trend came became a thing with the seaweed and the salmon and the rice we would eat seaweed like every single time i went to trader joe's and now it's completely sold out like i said in the previous vlog so kind of just sad about that it's like tiktok did you have to take away one of our favorite snacks did you have to but i'll get over it because i got some good stuff i need to adjust this camera but yeah i'm about to get into this haul ooh, ooh. all right y'all if it's crooked i'm sorry it's a lot going on um let me see if i can push it up okay so first i got the pumpkin rolls which i know y'all saw these are so freaking good, especially for the fall. Let me push y'all on. Bustin' Alert, the tomato feta soup. Bussin'. I'm not gonna compare it to Panera, but let's just say, let's just say that. Fire Bussin'. Okay, if you've never had Kerrygold butter, the best butter you'll ever have, ever to cook stuff in, to marinate stuff in, um, for baking, period. Uh, just got some fresh produce, blueberries, got some grapes as well. I needed some sweet potatoes. I got two packs of Gala Gala, however you want to pronounce them. Two packs of these apples. Um, I got the buttermilk bread my son loves. Mushrooms for salads. Um, got these cute little mini peppers. Uh, I could put these in salads or saute them. I got the red, these red potatoes because the air fryer has been my best friend for weeks ever since I got it. I got um, red onions, mandarins for my son's lunch. My son loves samosas. Let me put these in the freezer right now, actually. What else? Right, I got some spinach for my salads. I already have kale. And I already have um, kind of like a mix of like some other um, types of like lettuces, salads, but I go through a lot of salad and I also use kale to like cook with. So I wanted to make sure I got some spinach. Now, my son literally saw these and was like, can I have those? And so there were plain animal crackers and then there were these. Now, these have little alphabet uh, as the cookies, the alphabet. And I thought it would just be a cute, like, way for him to continue practicing his alphabet, spelling his name. But let me just say this. This is good. Oh, no. He might wake up and a whole alphabet missing. I'm going to just say... No, nah, let me not lie to him. But, like, for real, I'm going to have to tell him... It's so good. I tasted it because you know when like you see a kid snack, you just think, oh, it's a kid snack. This snack is snacking. It's giving very much. I used to watch a movie, Netflix, and eat these. It's so fire. I don't even know if I want to put y'all onto these. 
it's gonna be stop eating my son's cookies okay but they're called cinnamon school book cookies take me to school if they there take me back oh i'm inspired okay jumbo cinnamon rolls we love stuff like that for breakfast i need to get more breakfast foods all right so we usually don't eat too much cereal but these looks really good i've never tasted these these are almond butter puffs cereal i love almond butter if y'all know y'all know i usually make like almond butter toast with bananas and cinnamon but i can't wait to try that cereal and then here are like just the frosted wheats uh trader joe's version of it i got smoked salmon with everything bagel seasoning um, I toast the bread, I put avocado on it, and then I put strips of this on the bread. Um, my son loves it, and he eats it as eats it as lunch, like on the weekends when we're home. Um, I just got some pasta, but wait on this. Let me find let me find the pasta sauce I got. All right, y'all. I cannot wait to try this. It is. Um, creamy pasta sauce and it's made with pumpkin and butternut squash that sounds so yummy I cannot wait um, my son loves oatmeal I don't I used to be in love with cream of wheat when I was a kid but oatmeal I cannot um, I got cucumbers he loves these my son loves these lightly salted so do I I'm obsessed with cucumbers I got some honey crisp apple cider I guess my new hobby this <laughs> this fall has been trying new apple ciders from everywhere. The one at Randall's is really good, by the way, in case anyone cares. Um, dried mango because we love, like we're absolutely obsessed. Um, I've loved dried mango though since I was a kid. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, I got this toasted sesame dressing. I forgot to get sesame oil. I usually put sesame oil in my rice. It is so good. Um, especially in the rice cooker when you like marinate your rice but this is to marinate like tofu with or uh, I do vegan sausages and stuff like that um, so yeah and also says on the bottle that it is a versatile dressing and can be used for salads marinating and dips so there's that regular avocado fruit wash I do already have a spray bottle though so what i'm gonna try to do is pour some of this in this because i like the aspect of like being able to spray it versus this you have to pour it so i'm gonna try to see if i pour some of this after this is all gone if it'll spray normally um yeah but i was almost out so i needed some wash and that's for vegetables and fruit it's non-toxic and it gets all the dirt away and then i just got some bananas so yeah that is it for the haul i want to try one of these mango strips right now though yum let's see i love trader joe's like i'm i'm obsessed okay mm. it smells so good Mm, mm, mm. Mm, mm, mm. All right, little babies. Well, all I'm about to do is literally put all these groceries up, and then I need to get ready for my sale, which is in literally like 30 minutes. Actually, let's see less than that it's in 17 minutes so i'm going to get something to drink for the live i usually drink iced coffee because it's coffee plus clothes so yeah that's what i'm gonna do is get some coffee or something caffeinated and i'm just so excited to see my people be with my people uh, i think everyone's just been hyped since the store opened uh, which is such a good feeling that everyone is sharing kind of the same excitement as i am um, that people are genuinely happy for me and the shop and this community is just so great like 
I cannot stress it enough. I'm so grateful for this community. But yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and put all this stuff away in the refrigerator, get ready for that. And then I will see y'all. Mm, yeah, I'm gonna see y'all in the next vlog because this ran over, like a lot over. I, I didn't feel like I got that much stuff. But we almost had 10 minutes. So I think I will see y'all on Vlogtober day seven. And we'll just see what I end up doing. I'm probably going to do a thrift haul, which is going to be super fun. So make sure you come back, like, subscribe, comment, see me, and we'll see what I find. I need to go to multiple thrift stores, though. I've been really, like, only relying on a few, but I need to get out there. So I'll see y'all in the next vlog. Love you guys. Bye.